It's got eggs. They're the eggs, orange things. That, uh, that black spot there, that's the, what they call the tar. That holds the, uh, the fertilization stuff. Um, she's got to go back into the ocean because she's going to have babies for us next year. So we'll let her go. Uh, you can see all the growth over my things. Look at the digger and the nails right into my hand there. Look at that. <laughs> Anyway, we're going to throw it back. We've got to shoot back over that way. Um, I'll let it go back in the ocean. Get real quick on there. So, see you, Mrs. Crayfish. See you, Mrs. Crayfish. There she goes. Yep. She's got her own little building. Um, what do you call it? A homing device. She'll find her way back home. I'm going to go and get back on my mark. And I've got to have a look in the grey pot. You've got to have a look at the pot. Look at all the, yeah, all all the, the growth. growth on it. That's a brand new pot. Look at the growth on it. It's been sitting out in the Indian Ocean. Uh, 30 metres of water that we're dropping it in. Um, she's got to sink to the bottom of the ocean floor. Um, we just come from over there to drop my other one in. Um, there she goes. That's, uh, that's my other one. The other one's in there. One eating up one. Oh. There they go. That's my foot pump there. Oh, my wedge. See that? That's what pulls my spot up. I'm going to press the button. I'm going to press this button on the floor with my foot. And that. That's 
Which makes it so much easier. We didn't get anything today. Um, so we're going to pack back in home now. Um, the winds are going to start picking up shortly. Um, I think they've already started picking up. Look, look out there, it's pretty lumpy, lumpy. We just caught one female. It's a nice size one we showed this. Um, but long way to come out here. Fishing's going to start up again in another two weeks. So we're allowed to fish for the demersals. Um, I don't like fishing for pelagics too much. So I just rather fish for uh, the demersals. That's all bottom bouncing. That's what we catch off the bottom of the ocean for. We get the jewfish, the snapper, the break sea cod, the um, uh, whatever else lives down there. Sweet, sea sweet, banded sweet. Um, the end catches all sorts of other stuff down there as well. Yeah, it's a big variety of. But, uh, we like catching the uh, pink snapper because you feel like you've got a freight train on the end of your line. Yeah, no, they're awesome fighters. They're, they're good on the end of your rod. Yeah, they're pretty good fun to catch. And um, the jewfish, well, the West Australian jewfish, that's a prize catch here in WA. You catch one of them and uh, you're doing pretty fucking good. We've caught a couple last year, I think we caught three nice size ones. Um, so you don't catch them every day, but when you do, it's good to uh, show the rest of the world what you got. And they're uh, just a WA fish, West Australian Jew fish. Uh, anyway, we're going to cut back in now, so we can get this on the uh, computer and download it and upload it and inload it and <laughs> load. See how we go. Yeah, and chat to you soon. Take care, people, tight lines, and uh, all the best is on your fishing little fishing adventures. This is. Uh, we do, uh, do well in another two weeks, I think. What time the fishing end? It's 15th. Uh, the 16th of December, we can fish. We'll be out here on the 16th, but we're going to go out another 25 kilometres out. We've got a nice little lump out there that we like to fish on. We've only fished on it once. So, uh, on the 16th, hopefully we get a nice day and we can go right out. And uh, if we get that on film, um, you'll see me carrying on like a uh, little kid again. See ya. See ya.